Hey YouTube, in this video I'm going to show you how to add uh, wireless uh, or Wi-Fi to your home network. If all you've got right now is a modem, you'll probably uh, soon realize the shortcomings of not having Wi-Fi access and only having the ability to plug in one computer at a time via an Ethernet cable that comes out the back. So in order to add Wi-Fi access to your house, you can either have your service provider give you a router, uh, not for free of course, and it's probably going to be a rip off if you go through them. Uh, so the best way to do it is to go to your local Best Buy or go online or go to Walmart and buy a router. They're pretty universal, doesn't really matter who makes it because everything's uh, pretty much compatible nowadays, but if you buy a modem or a router, sorry, for 25 to 35 bucks, you can unbox it, bring it home, and hooking it up is not terribly difficult. It may look intimidating because of all the buttons and switches on the back, but all you really need to know is that uh, you know which one is power. Uh, you'll see typically five Ethernet jacks in the back, one of which looks different than the others. Uh, this one's labeled Internet. And all that tells you is this is where the cable coming from your modem plugs into on the back. So you plug that in, you plug in, you plug in your power, and now to configure your router, what you need to do is take a second Ethernet cable, plug it into any of the other spots, and plug that into your computer. If you turn on your computer, turn on your modem and router, um, and you navigate to your browser, uh, you can type in, uh, this is just an example, but it will be in your manual for your router, uh, type in an address that's something something like this, 192.168.1.1, hit enter, and what should pop up is a little login screen that says, okay, what's your login and what's your password? Now, it'll be set to the default from the factory, so your manual should have that too. Is typically um, admin admin is your username and password. And once you log in the first time, uh, the typical router will walk you through a pretty easy setup process saying, okay, enable my Wi-Fi and here's what I want my password to be. And that's going to be pretty easy to click through. So once you do that, uh, you can just close your browser and... Um, uh, unplug your uh, Ethernet cable coming from your computer. So leave this guy plugged in to your modem. But your Wi-Fi should should be enabled from there, and then you can go ahead like you normally would and search for networks, and you'll see this new router appear as a source of uh, wireless access, and you can just log in using the new password that you set. And um, that's all there really is to it. There's uh, you can you can do a lot of fancy things with these things. Uh, you know with you know all the settings you're gonna find inside uh, you know kind of the the software screen once you log in but that's that's pretty much the bare minimum you need to know to just get Wi-Fi access in your house so I hope that's been helpful I mean there's there's a lot more you can you can learn about these things if you really want to but that's that's it that's uh, that's the basics of what you have to know so thanks for watching I hope that was helpful to somebody out there just to explain you know, what do I have to do to get Wi-Fi access in my house? Well, that's what you got to do. Just buy it, set it up in a couple easy steps, plug it in, and you're good to go. Thanks for watching.